morning, Tuesday 12th of June. It should be hopefully our last day in Turkey. We should cross the border today. We'll see if that can happen. But uh, now we're just sitting here having our breakfast here next to Silda Lake. Had an extremely quiet night here. Apart from a thunderstorm in the night, but we was luckily in our tin. So. <laughs> Now we want to tell how we have experienced Turkey from a cyclist point of view, touring cyclist point of view. Yeah, not, uh, not an airplane China holiday, but from a biker's point of view. Bikes are loaded. Now we've got 50 kilometers until the border of Georgia. Let's uh, see if we can get there today. See if we can get there today, yeah. Hopefully. All goes well, should be there today if the border crossing is open and all that stuff. But, uh, yeah. So that'll be uh, the end of Turkey, maybe. Let's uh, see what happens today. Just noticed there's even a brand new toilet building here. Ah. We have been nature toileting. I never expected anything like this. Oh, yeah. oh we <laughs> Just when we come out of this car, we noticed. it's brilliant. It look new and clean and everything. Oh, never mind. Yeah, never mind. Let's go. Okay, bikes are rolling. Oh, it's George. We actually did more climbing yesterday than we realised. Now we're near the summit, 2,070 meters. <laughs> we hope it's downhill to Georgia from here. Oh, that'd be nice. <laughs> it was a bit high yesterday for some reason. Yeah, that's why. Past 4,000 kilometers as well yesterday. Just noticed this morning, actually realized yesterday. Now we're doing 4,030 kilometers so far since we left Croatia. Beautiful part of the world here. Reminds me more of Scotland than anything we've seen in Turkey. It's just so green and lush. Nice rolling mountains. A lake or coastline is not always as flat as you would expect. It is, climbs up and down all the way around this lake. I have learned on the team we home, I have watching in the home, is we have seen some nature program and there there was some, some birds from the air making the nest in some holes. So now you can see there. Okay, we're turning away from the lake, we're going out the northern part of it, so I don't need to think that we came in all the way down there yesterday. Now we're leaving it at the north now, we head to a town called Sidley, a actual town of Sidley, so we can get some lunch there before we head to the border. Now we are very close to Sidley, and uh, now we are very close, very close to the border. Roadside place here. It's probably be the last time we have. It's actually open, yes. And they have kebabs. We've seen. So. <laughs> I'll show you the kebabs. What you can eat here. Actual real food. Nice kebabs here yeah. with lamb that we're going to have and some chicken. <laughs> uh, mountain food for our last, our last lunch in Turkey. <laughs> nice kebabs here. Yeah. 
got a nice protector dog down there taking care of the bike. Biking machine here. No brakes. A good speedometer so you can see how far you're going. <laughs> yeah, fast. <laughs> and a good saddle. Well, it's funny these places we turn up in to buy food. First thing they ask is where you're from, and then you tell them from Denmark, and they just always look puzzled. <laughs> it's just, they have no idea where it is, and you try and say it in three different ways Denmark, 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 Denmark. And in the end, they seem to get some idea what we're talking about. <laughs> so it's not a place people really know anything about. So, okay, that was our last uh, shopping, then we'll head off to the border now to Georgia. Okay, this way to Gorkistan. Georgia, Turkish. One thing I've noticed in all the time in Turkey is that you never see any cars with any other registration plates other than Turkish. Apart from, uh, I think I've seen one German uh, camper. I think that was actually yesterday. We saw one German camper. He must have been on the way to the border here as well. Uh, apart from that, and one guy that we met in Gurim on a motorbike, apart from that you just see, only see Turkish cars. Not like in Europe where you see a mixture of cars from different nationalities. Here the number plates only ever say TR, Turkey. making us work hard to get out and one last steep climb here before we get to the border. It's, uh, it's going okay, nice and sunny, amazing views. Rakim here in Turkey. We hope so. We hope so. We told you this morning Turkey was pretty flat, but there's actually been quite a few Rakims after all. But, uh... And we had looked on the map on the computer that this was downhill, but it was actually uphill, so a bit of a mistake there. So we hope it's the last one now. Yeah, it's downhill to Georgia from here. Are you sure? <laughs> this one was 2,159 meters. And Jamie wants to take the wave there. Okay, let's go down to Georgia. Behind the lake here, that's Georgia. That's our first sight of it. Just have to go down this mountain first. That's gonna be fun. kilometers across Turkey. Now we're minutes from the border now, just one downhill. See if we can get stamped out of Turkey, stamped into Georgia. That's the next project. Going through the passport check, we've just been stamped out of Turkey. We'll have to see how we get into Georgia. 
very long corridor we have to walk down to get into Georgia. <laughs> that didn't take long. Five minutes there, three stamps, and away we go. It feels more like we're coming through an airport there. We've just gone through like a customs place and passport control. <laughs> we're gonna go into Georgia. There's two passport controls in Turkey. No uh let's see if we can get into Georgia. Getting stumped into Georgia. Now we are finished with Turkey. We did, did it! it. <laughs> hip hip hooray! Yeah, uh, oh, not hip hip hooray, we enjoyed Turkey a lot. We enjoyed it a lot. Uh, but it's nice to have done it now and finished it. Um, yeah. And we achieved that. Yeah. That was a good 47 days, we really enjoyed it. So I can't actually believe we've been in Turkey for 47 days. <laughs> and now I'm beginning to, uh, I want to go back to Turkey. Yeah. <laughs> and luckily we have a lot of excitement to come. We left Cappadocia and it was 1000 kilometers to go here to the border, so we're never gonna get there, but... Well, we did. Now we're here. Mm, yeah. So but thank you Turkey for a very good experience. Very good experience. Really nice. Yeah. Very good. Thank yeah. you Turkey. So now we left a country where they basically don't drink wine or drink alcohol to a country that invented winemaking. Both Georgia and Armenia claim to have invented winemaking, so we'll see if we can find a glass of wine one of the days. <laughs> so yeah, that was it. Uh, that was Turkey. Yeah. Okay. Let's go and see Georgia. Hip hip hooray! Now we have changed our money from uh, Turkish money <coughs> to Georgia money and this is 100. Mm -hmm. That's what it looks like. Funny. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's that done. So we can buy food here in Georgia for the next day and a half. The Georgia, the Georgia people are very friendly. When we was in there and we have changed, they all give us their. They, she has given us my the, uh, chocolate biscuit. <laughs> Bikes are rolling in Georgia. Who would have believed that? <laughs> there we go. Nice to camp somewhere, maybe on the Lank Lake here. We have actually done more than 4,000 now. Oh, yeah. So that is pretty much. Yesterday we forgot to say it, but we have done 4,000. That was quite an easy board across the reeling, quite nice. New building, very quiet, everything with you. Apart from a few trucks coming from Iran, we were the only. People crossing really. Okay, we just biked what? Three kilometers up to the border. Found a nice space here behind a small, some wood here and then there's some nice seals to look at tonight. So this will be our first camping spot in Georgia. We'll uh, get the tent up now and then time for dinner and then we'll bike through Georgia tomorrow. Okay, tent's up. Cooker's going nicely. Nice. Evening here, kind of farmer's field camping. Yeah. Quite a nice place really, nice and quiet. <laughs> 